you make me wanna talk back Talk back to you Say you say you like that If I hate you then find someone new Baby but you know I never will No So I choke you down yesterday with my massage therapist just to flush out my body before the big race just want to make sure I'm going to be nice and fresh uh, so I'm feeling a little bit tired today I think it's from the massage so just trying to stay really hydrated eat lots of fruits and veggies of course and just see how I feel for the rest of the day the weather's pretty good today has been raining but hopefully it stays nice um, yeah, so this walk is a bit of a hike, so nice big hill, we're just going down a gorge right now, so it's one massive gorge, so going downhill at the moment, see how we go on the uphill, um, yeah, just feeling a bit tired, so hopefully this freshens me up a bit, <laughs> okay, I'll see you guys at the top, it's an awesome view, so... What a difference moving the body can make. I feel so much more energized now. I feel awake. I feel good. Got a bit of a sweat on. I ran for probably 2Ks. Back, we're almost back at the car. We're just going down to the bottom of the gorge and then we just walk up to the top. I really enjoy adventure racing, it is a lots of fun. I think because you get to do it as a team, so you're in it together the whole way. You get to motivate each other, you get to push each other, probably a, further than what you would push yourself. So I can't wait for the weekend, I'm feeling really pumped for it. Donkey. Um, it should be an awesome day. So last adventure race I did, which was my first adventure race last year in October, I sprained my ankle six weeks before it and it was a really bad sprain. 
I couldn't even walk. So going to the physio twice a week, every week doing dry needling and ultrasound therapy and all kinds of stuff like that. So that definitely helped my recovery. So I still did the race, felt strong the whole way through. My ankle did not bother me at all. I'll show you a picture. You know I never will, no. So I choke you down just like a So this time around feels really good because I can actually run, which is awesome. I'm not a runner, I've never enjoyed running, but I am actually enjoying running now. So that's awesome. Such a huge change from last time. So definitely feeling a lot stronger and a lot more positive. The week leading up to any race can be a little bit daunting because you're always thinking, have I done enough? Could I have done more? But at the end of the day, that's it, it's done. You've done your training. There's nothing else you can do. The only thing you can really concentrate on is nutrition the week before, really important, and also staying hydrated. So I'll show you what I eat for the rest of the day, and I hope you enjoy. Let's get to the top. So this is my lunch, so we're going to put some coconut water, four bananas, lots of berries, and some of this raw organic superfood smoothie mix, which is really, really tasty. And that will be my lunch today. Yeah. Hey. Yeah. 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 Yeah.